Flames kicked off their season on Monday night with a convincing 104-38 win over Regent alongside Paul Nazgian. I'm Matt Warner. Naz, the Flames are expected to win. They're expected to win handily in this one. But did you see the things you wanted to see from the Flames on this night that you think will show well throughout the season? Yeah, I wanted to see dunks and fast breaks <laughs> and three-pointers. Yeah. Uh, we saw a lot of great things that way. But there were some things that I wanted to make sure we didn't see. I didn't want to see sloppiness. I didn't want to see sort of a casual approach to a lesser appointed, opponent. And we didn't see that. Yeah. Flames were focused, locked in, played with a lot of intensity the whole game. Yeah, let's take a look at some of the highlights from this one. And, of course, it all starts with Darius McGee, the two-time ace on player of the year and he was spectacular tonight 17 points leading the way for the flames yeah hitting some classic deep rate of threes <laughs> but uh you know distributed as well um so i'm taking off the dribble a little bit of everything from darius as we've come to expect and then one of the younger players sophomore joseph vinzant always known as a great defender showcased some of that offensive ability here this evening as well he had 11 points to go along with seven rebounds yeah a couple threes some some inside penetrations i like that the flames were getting out and running and JV was on the receiving end a few of those fast breaks as and well. And in the second half, Brody Peebles came alive offensively. He finished with 17, 11 of those coming after the break. And again, you think of him as a great shooter, but he can also get to the rim, and he did that tonight. Yeah, some other guys were scoring, you know, five and double figures. And just when you forgot about Brody, he appears in the second half, 11 second half points. Guy a little bit inside, outside. I expect big things from him moving forward. See the top performers also not shown. Colin Porter, the freshman with eight assists. Yeah. A nice start to his career yes. along with the other freshman, Zach Cleveland. The road gets more difficult from here. The Flames head to Alabama on Friday where they'll take on the Crimson Tide at 8 o'clock.